Packing for the trip of a lifetime. In just a couple of days, Sarah and her teammates will leave the small town of Khalifi on the Kenyan coast to fly to Johannesburg for the World Cup. Not to watch, but to play in a tournament running alongside the main event. A competition called Football for Hope, which brings together football projects from around the world, which help disadvantaged youngsters. I, I'm happy because that is my first time to fly out of Kenya. And I'm glad to, to go there so that I can, I can learn more about football. Moving the goalposts, or MTG, was set up eight years ago to help young girls and women in Khalifi and the surrounding areas fulfil their potential. They use football to bring the girls together while encouraging them and, more importantly, their families that they should stay in school. I started playing football in 2004. I learned that MTG and football help us when we, are, we have any problem. Like her teammates, Happy attends the local school. MTG is currently working with more than 3,000 young girls in the region and organises training sessions, matches and tournaments which the girls run and referee themselves. Once training for the day is over, a youth leader talks to them about a range of subjects. As the girls come together, play football, they share what they, are, they face in their lives, what they face in their community, and also uh, teach each other. Competition for a place in the team travelling to South Africa was intense. The selected girls had to go through three interviews and be more than capable on the football pitch, because they know they're not just going to make up the numbers, but to try to bring some football success to Africa.